Hello and welcome to another update video about Koti. Um, Koti continues to trade within a descending wedge in my opinion here. As you remember, um, we came all the way up to 65 cents here at the all-time high, which was, well, three weeks ago roughly. And since then we've been in a consolidation, in my view, a bullish consolidation. We have held support levels um, really well. We are still above the 50-day moving average, which is the blue line here, and above the 200-day moving average, which is the yellow line there. And um, yeah, we haven't really dropped any anywhere below 46 cents. So we are still trading um, on this support line. It's slightly descending, so we're making lower lows. We also make uh, lower highs, but it's not a channel. It's actually a, a descending wedge, which essentially is a bullish pattern. And I would expect now, um, it looked it looked before, it looked a bit like an, um, a descending triangle, which would be rather a bearish pattern. But overall, you know, we are in an uptrend and we are in a descending wedge in my opinion which could just be something like a larger bull flag here which could essentially um yeah break break out to the upside maybe some doing something like that here i don't know if you see that actually um one second to zoom in here all right doing something um like that here yeah where we move up from there um potentially so yeah I think um, we are about to break out very, very soon here. Let's just take these out. We are about to break out very, very soon here to the upside, I think. Um, again, no break to the upside is guaranteed. We could also break to the downside potentially. And I did say in a previous video, we'll most likely find our first support here at 45 cents, which is that previous high, which is um, at yeah, 45 and a half, yeah, roughly. 45, 45 and a half cents. And below that, we have also coming up very, very closely the 50 day moving average, which is now sitting at around 44 cents. So that is catching up. So we might not fall quite far anymore. Um, if we should really lose that for whatever reason, I think we can come down to this um, ascending trend line again. And since then, you know, nothing has really changed. I'm just waiting for that breakout. The indicators haven't really changed since the last update video. Uh, by the way, this is the four hour chart. But on the on the hourly, we, we're just waiting for for that breakout pretty much. And um, I put the extension levels on the chart here before. These are the Fibonacci extension levels. Uh, basically, that level where we are now is also an important Fibonacci retracement level, the 0.382 Fibonacci retracement level at around 46 and a half cents. That is also why we had a lot of support here. Um, but from here, we can obviously go up all the way up to the um, if we manage to break to the upside and we find our way up to the 65 to I think it's exactly 70 cents I'm um, just below 70 cents where we had the all-time high from there we can address the 1.272 Fibonacci extension level which is at 85 cents and above that we've got one dollar and six which is the 1.618 extension level in my view all very achievable targets for um for the alt season maybe even more you know I always try to stay on a little bit on the conservative side of things here not to overhype things um, but I think you know definitely a 2x possibly 3 or 4x from here should really be possible if we have another very very nice alt season run and bear in mind I did say it in previous videos we will still have the alt season coming we are not in the alt season yet we are on our way from the Bitcoin season into the alt season at the moment so um just need to come out of this uh, pattern so it can't be long really it can't be long um, maybe a few more days we're also coming down here on the um, the 50 now we actually dropped below the 50 line now on the RSI well not necessarily a problem we just dropped slightly below it just means that we have more scope to the upside and um, there you go we're just waiting for that breakout makes me hope that it's an ascending um, a descending wedge so a bullish pattern and also overall we are in an uptrend so we should really see that breakout to the upside all right so hopefully um you liked the update if you did please smash the like button and also subscribe to the channel if you like the content thanks a lot for watching bye bye